Hello everyone, back as promised, new Special Heroes trailer, reaction, Andy, all things in balance. Unless you're not subscribed, in which case we're not in balance and you should fix that. Like Clockwork! Oddly enough, is what the title of this banner is, for some reason. Um... Okay, <laughs> sure. I don't know who's on this banner. I'm pretty sure it's Lear and uh, Fafnir. And I, again, I said m like a month or so ago, predicting every special banner. I'm pretty sure it's going to be Regan and Oter Duo. I don't know who the freebies are going to be, which is why I have my iPad over here just to just to double check as I grind last minute uh, on the Fate Go event because I need my last Nightingale NP copy. Anyway, that's it's not important. <laughs> Nobody cares about that. All right, New Year's. Wishing for a happy New Year. Are you now? Hmm. Oh. Okay. Since it's a new year, I fixed Not a new year so it's sparkling. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh well. Okay. Uh cross spur attack. We're gonna take a look at that. Feeling lucky? Oh, she's in her Okay. Fafnir? You are in the presence of Fafnir, Neath of Valir's king. Fafnir. Greetings in this new year. Well, I really king anymore, buddy. We gotta talk. We have to fill in some gaps for you, cause Eternal Night. There's some stuff that happened, my dude. Uh, Lear. Here. Love it. Okay. So then there's a duo, right? Or a ha I guess it doesn't have to be a duo. Lear's the four star? No. She has a sex me catch! No shot. Wow, you look amazing in that kimono. I know you only say that because we're twins. Failure is not an option. What? Yeah, we're gonna spark for them. Uh huh. Yeah, we're sparking for them. <clears throat> we're gonna be sparking for them. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yep, 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 yep. yep. Alright, so no, no summer. No summer uh, for the Jotun sisters, but. Uh, maybe that's okay. New Year's is hype. Everybody looking cute. So it's got to be, it's got to be a free Tellius unit then, right? <gasps> is that who I think it is? Yo. Yo. Is that who I think it is? And we have a green five star. As your beloved Faye pass spark. Okay. Well, uh, we're definitely going to spark for uh, the new duo. Naturally. No reason not to. Uh, let's walk it back real quick. And just double check and see who we have as our free unit here. I think I know who he is. Kaiza, yeah. Okay, cool. Confirmed. Confirmed Kaiza. Uh, that's hype, actually. So, again, beast units and uh, OCs. So that's that's kind of cool, man. Faye, or I guess Heroes and Tellius, but I guess maybe it's Radiant Dawn? I think it's Radiant Dawn. Uh, um, 
That's pretty hype. Okay. So Reagan is uh blue tone cav. Poggers. Love that. Oh boy. Okay. So we know uh Seder Shell, we know Swiss Pharaoh 3. Cross spur attack. Grants attack plus five to allies in cardinal directions of unit during combat. Interesting. That, unless you're talking like vertical, that seems much more of a difficult path to hit. Or maybe it's not. Maybe I'll have someone come on the channel and help me explain ether rates. Who knows? You'll have to you'll have to stay tuned. Uh need of a leader lots. Red stack plus three enables Kanto. During turns one through four. Start turn four, grant special cooldown count minus three to unit. Uh, start of combat, if unit's HP is greater than 25%, grant stack speed plus six to unit during combat. Okay. Cool. So not bad. Not bad. That's Regan. Then we had Fafnir. Fafnir. Uh, he is a red dagger cav unit. He has a bit more lengthy stuff. Uh, Glimmer, attack speed solo, disarm trap. Rouse attack defense four. So the newest rouse four skill. Basically, null panic, attack defense plus six. We know this. Uh, Need of a leader sprig grants speed plus three, enables Kanto during turns one through four. If you initiates combat or is not adjacent to an ally, grants attack speed, defense, res plus five to unit. Neutralizes effects that prevent units follow up attacks and inflict special cooldown charge minus one on foe per attack during combat. Okay, cool. I'm glad Oter's not here. He's kind of a wad, you know what I mean? Like, we just we don't really like him that much. Um, <laughs> Nina Belier, I, like, these things don't seem like crazy crazy, which I guess is kind of nice. This is like a lot, obviously. Like, this is obviously a lot, but um, maybe it is a lot. I don't know. I'm tired, man. All right, Lear, Colorless Cav Beast, who I believe is also our four star. Yeah, pretty sure it said that. Um, so, OK, it's, OK, it's three. It's attack speed catch three. OK, that makes more sense. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, no. OK, so that makes more sense. It's not catch four, it's catch three at a four star, which is honestly really good. Like, that's good for inheritance. Um, dual chills, however, maybe not. Dual chill is makes it makes me feel bad. Um, Luna, attack speed catch three. OK. Um, Sparkling Fang, that's fun. Grant speed plus three at start of combat. The foe's HP is greater than 75 percent. Uh, grants attack speed plus 16 during combat, and also if unit speed is greater than post speed, grants special cooldown charge plus one, grants attack, and deals five damage. Oh, okay, so it's uh, it's flashing blade. We also have flashing blade on here too, which is cool. Uh, includes when dealing damage, okay, yeah, she's got flashing blade built in, uh, and also conditional Swiss Sparrow, I guess. No, just kind of a just a buff, conditional buff. Yeah, OK, uh, cool. Well, that's a really good four star unit, honestly. Like there's a lot happening here and she is going to be a colorless beast, a very fast colorless beast um, and a colorless beast at four star, much like Pirate Vika is pretty good value. I think I'll stand by that. I'll die on that hill. I think that's a good value type unit. Um, this. Oh, mama. OK, so the Jotun sisters are here to celebrate New Year's. I thought I was going to get off easy. I'm obviously very much not going to get off easy. Cuboon is even drawing the art. So nat naturally, um, <laughs> Can't, I can't I can't escape Cuban. <laughs> Cuban is everywhere. Ah, all right. So let's see. Tax speed push four. 
Sun Twin Wing. Um, attack defense rain. Okay. We are a flying green bow. Is that right? Are we a flying unit? I think we're a flyer, right? We are a flying green bow. That is correct. <sighs> Jotnar bow. Oh, they give Pathfinder. Oh, God. Celerate special trigger. Love that. Uh, effective against flying foes. If a unit initiates combat or is within two spaces of an ally, inflicts attack speed, defense minus five on foe during combat, and inflicts penalty on foes, attack speed, defense during combat, equal to current bonus on each of units, attack speed, defense. Wow. Okay. Okay. That's good. I'm already theory crafting. I know I may be giving off some some odd silent vibes, but I'm going to get them. I'm going to build them. I'm taking a different approach this year. I think I think the idea of plus tenning stuff so quickly is a bad idea. And so I'm going to approach the next year uh, with the concept of just getting a good unit maybe getting a merge on them hopefully getting a merge on them but not really taking it to an extreme also i have to save it for a house and the market inflation is like insane so i'm just i'm gonna focus i will i will try to get two copies so we can merge maybe change their ivs to be something more um optimal if possible but I, I think that that is how I'm going to approach this new year. And I think this is the perfect example because I really like these two. I really like Jotun in general. Um, easily my favorite, you know, theme for resplendence and stuff. I think this is the perfect example for me to do that with. And I, I already have like a cool concept in my head um, for this unit. So we'll probably do something buildy wise on stream in the next week or two uh, after this banner debuts, of course. So that is going to be my plan. Yeah, we're going to do we're going to do something cool with them for sure, for sure, for sure. Uh, our duo skill grants attack speed, defense res plus six and pathfinder to unit and wait, what? <laughs> it gives pathfinder to allies. What? I'm not misreading that, right? A buff of six to all stats and Pathfinder to unit and allies within five rows and five columns centered on unit for one turn. That's a bad idea, right? <laughs> like, no one should look at this and be like, oh yeah, that's balanced. You could literally just hopscotch with calves and like clear the entire map. Right? Am I crazy? Oh, there's going to be some nonsense here. <laughs> there's going to there's going to be some nonsense with that. Oh god. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Sure. Yeah, that seems Aw, Oter isn't festive. Oh, wait, is he festive? Wait, is he festive? He's not festive. Okay, no, he's not. He's not festive. He is not festive. I kind of want to see the animation again. 99 time times two. To proper beginnings. Okay. All right, I'm on board with this banner. Uh, it's not anything like too crazy crazy The duo skill we're gonna have to have a talk about that duo skill uh, Kaiza is also the red beast, which is poggers uh, Also, I think tiger And we don't we don't typically get a lot of tiger beast units hmm. So that's fun. Uh, I don't think we have any intel on him just yet so uh, we'll we'll take a looky loo when he comes out in full. Um, but right now, I think that's that, man. I think that's that. Uh, I will be utilizing my God-given right of Faith Pass Sparking, I guess, for uh, for Note Dogger, 
and uh, call it good. I guess. That's hype. Seems good. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. We'll have a summon session go up sometime shortly. Uh, I think two days from now. I think the Tempest Trials banner starts tomorrow or today, depending on how late you're watching this. Um, and then this banner comes out the day after that. So I think this one comes out on Wednesday for me. Uh, quite possibly Tuesday for West Coast. So. Hype. Hype in chat. Uh, that is it. I am super... I'm, I'm pretty... I'm genuinely pretty stoked for these ladies. No no lie. No cap. Uh, I am, I know I, I gave note, uh, like, just the worst time. But listen, I'm still a fan. Okay? I have a thing for green hair and older sister archetypes, I guess. I don't really know what that says about me, but... Oh well. Anyway, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Subscribe. Come back for more. Uh, and until then, I will catch you next time.